So in this video, I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on how we can make a viewfinder, okay? So here's an example of a viewfinder I have made. And as you can see there, I've actually drawn my hand on this viewfinder. So that can just go to show how easy the viewfinders are to use. So for making a viewfinder, what you're going to need is some cardboard. So we've got some cardboard here. Um, you're going to need a scissors. You're going to need a pencil, a rubber in case you make any mistakes, and essentially you're going to need a ruler, okay? So, next I'm going to go then and I'm going to show you how we can, we can start making our viewfinder, okay? So if you look at it here, this viewfinder I've made, you can see here that I've made it out of two L shapes. So when I first went, <coughs> was cut out an L shape, and then cut out a second one and glued it. Then what I done is I put my I put my acetate of, through that. So I did, and then I glued it on. So we're also gonna need some glue for gluing that on, but we'll come to that later on, okay? So I'm just gonna start off by cutting out two edge shapes. Now you can cut out um, it doesn't matter what size you want to make it out. This this one I made it so that it was around the size of my hand. So roughly it's around the size of an A4 piece of paper. So if I just grab a piece of A4 paper, paper here, and you can see it's, it's roughly around the size of an A4 piece of paper. A bit in smaller, okay? So we're going to make it around the size of an A4 piece of paper, okay? Just for the purpose of these tutorials. But you can make it for whatever size you want yourself. Okay, so I'm just going to go and start doing that now. Okay, so I have a piece of A4 paper here, so I'm going to make my viewfinder the size of an A4 piece of paper, just for convenience sake. Um, what I'm going to do then is I'm just going to get my ruler and I'm going to mark down here in the piece of paper. Now, as you can see, I have my piece of cardboard here. So I'm just going to make sure that I have a straight edge first and foremost. And I'm going to put this piece of paper right down in there, okay? Now, I already have this squared off, this piece of cardboard. So I'm sure that when you're making your own uh, view, viewfinders, that yours is um, squared off also. Okay, so I can actually start by making mine in the corner here. You put that there. Now I'm just going to mark a little tick at the top here of the viewfinder, and also at the side here. Now I'm going to mark out an end shape for cutting into the viewfinder. Okay, so. This square edge down on top of that. Okay, so make sure that it's right angled. So a light line up. Same coming out down here. So edge up against to make sure it's right angled. So a light line up. Now, if I make this 40 millimeters, it'll be a split. So it's naked. 40 and I'm just going to mark up another 40 down here. Now I'm going to join them two points through. And I'm going to mark out 40 here. And 40 here also. And then I'm just going to go and join these two points back. Okay, so now we know that there's one part of my viewfinder right there.
you have to do now is glue them in place. So there's two ways you can do it. You can glue this in first. And that's what it says. Find your fingers not to get any good on it. Yep. Just check now that that's square. That is square. It's quite good. So then you can just put pressure down on that again. And turn it over and do the same trick. Try and spread your, your Loctite glue out. Okay, now there you go. Here's your fuel finder.